hey guys what's up back with another video this one is going to be like a decorate with me girl talk and what's on my iphone christmas edition so tune in get some popcorn get some coffee tea water and watch with me will be like right here and then I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about On my iPhone so that is my home page I have the calendar little picture that I put my background is like that swipe I have my red yellow one is also like yellow Christmas list. and then this walk collage groups and that's basically it. let's get into the first one I have is advice on toxic and fake friends slash how to make new friends okay so advice on toxic and fake friends I kind of went on this in my girl talk episode one but honestly if you notice they're like kind of being like flaky on and also the toxic ones like if you notice kind of weird and then even like your parents just like say like it's not a good influence on you kind of like think about it. and then maybe talk to them and if they don't understand and they fight back then you know what bye <laughs> and then how to make new friends just like a lot of times it's really helpful when there's like these like group assignments or dance or some like introductions like on the first day of school like college whatever through that you can always make new friends you know start talking to new people from classes or whatever if you could go back in time and give your teenage self one piece of advice what would it be if i could i'd probably maybe like try and like talk more to people like be more social interactive and like think sometimes before i do stuff and tips of staying positive i honestly just like always think positive of everything even like when i'm feeling down 
I'm always like, oh, positive part, <laughs> you know? So. In a, I don't know what RLT is. If someone doesn't want to do things is it wrong or normal? It's not wrong. It's normal not to do those type of things. I honestly wasn't one to do those things. I think I tried it once with my friend, but I honestly never did it. But yeah, it's normal to not want. <laughs> Especially like if you're like younger than 18, yeah, it's really not normal. Not normal, it's really normal. <laughs> Sorry. How can we stop being insecure and seeking for boys' attention? So stop being insecure. Honestly, just try and love you for you. I always think to stop being insecure and like stop comparing yourself to others. I know like it's kind of hard because like we have access to literally everything. And so with that, it is hard, but like just think about it like whatever you're seeing or watching on like Instagram or YouTube, whatever, or Netflix, for example, just think like that's that person they might either photoshop themselves or they might just be like that i don't know who knows they might have a past and then i don't know but yeah don't ever compare yourself with others it's just not <laughs> to do. seeking for boys attention don't seek their attention that's just a no <laughs> just i don't know be friends with everyone doesn't matter the gender and if you can't be friends of the opposite gender, it'll, it'll go. Like, once you grow, it'll go. I wasn't much friends with the opposite gender when I was younger. I started having more guy friends when I got older, let's say 17 or 16. So between 16 and 17, I definitely had more like and of all types of gender just don't seek a boy's attention like i met my boyfriend because he just saw me and it's like hey what's up <laughs> okay but we can get into that maybe if you want to comment down below <laughs> okay so if you liked it like it comment down below that and subscribe if you're new watching I'll see you guys in the next video.